Okay, got two freebies. What's well, kind of one freebie? It's a two can freebie. Two two can knock knock. Who's there? Two can two can who? Two can live as cheaply as one, from the old knock knock jokes. Uh, but I got these. Uh, one is a cola and one is a root beer. Now they said the person sent to me said that the cola in blind taste tests sometimes will be picked as the best tasting one. They'll have like a, uh, uh, a, a little bit of Coca-Cola, a little Pepsi, maybe some um, RC, uh, what other companies are out there? Um, Shasta Cola, all those. Um, and they said sometimes people say that's, I think that one tastes the best. So uh, it's zero sugar, zero carbs. They're from California, from a town called Lark spur, lark. I guess like the bird and a spur. What does that mean? Is it on this claw? I don't know what a lark spur is, but we're gonna try this. What I'm gonna do? I'm not gonna drink the entire thing. Um, I will probably drink maybe about half in a glass, and then I will cover it up and drink the rest later, or you know, give it away. So we have cola and we have root beer. Now I didn't hear anything about the root beer tasting, just like mug root beer or dad's root beer or Barg's root beer. Or, any of those A and W root beer. I'm not sure about that, but this one here, they said tastes really, really close to Coca-Cola. That's for me, I'm not trying it yet. I'm, of course I'm skeptical because the fact that this is made with pure carbonated water, organic caramel color. Now some of the, uh, of these, like the, was it a Zevia, Ziva, Ziva, whatever, uh, those, they are clear. They don't have any coloring. So I don't like that. They pour in a glass and it's clear, but it's supposed to taste like cola. And they said that that does not taste like cola, but they said this does. Uh, that this is really good. It, um, this was founded by Nicole Bernard Dawes or Dawes Days Dawes, uh, and uh, Dixie no drink Nixie.com is their thing. But here is the what is in it. I mean, what, here's the calories, of course, and the carb zero. And here is what they make it with. And let's go ahead and open it. We'll see if it performs <laughs> like. Uh, perhaps Coca-Cola looks like the coloring I mean, of the can it looks like they're trying to be uh, some to cola this is what it kind of looks like it's, it's, it's pretty foamy I'm gonna pour some in this glass and we'll see if it ooh, it's very very foamy <laughs> be careful if you decide to pour these in a glass it is very very foamy so I didn't shake it up didn't drop it um, so you can hear it you hear that? You smell it? <laughs> so anyway, um, yeah, uh, really a foamy, foamy drink. Foamy for homie, but it is like this. And I will now try it, and then I'll try the root beer. Now this is not a scientific test. I'm not gonna run and get a different glass to try the root beer, or wash this out and sanitize it, and then try it again and make sure the sanitizer is a non, has no flavoring, no taste to it or whatever. This is just to try this. I, the reason I'm doing this video, by the way, this will be out on, I believe, Monday. Don't forget to subscribe. I did get over 14,000 subscribers. 5, 10, 4,000. <laughs> Until it's 14,000. But I did get over 14,000. Thank you very much for those of you who subscribed. Uh, this right here, I will probably have it out on Monday. Today is, I'll, I'll let you know, today is Wednesday. It's Whopper Wednesday at Burger King. Um, if you want to modify a Whopper to your uh, health dietary needs. Um, but I'm going to try it now. Very good. This, so far, I believe would probably be my, I don't know how many different zero calorie drinks of this type that I've tried. Now, there's, this is zero sugar. Diet Pepsi, Diet Coke, Diet RC, Diet Right, Diet Shasta, Diet whatever. They have those. Um, but this tastes better to me than those. Yep. It even gives you a little bit of a burp. So, um, yeah, that's that was pretty good. So I'm saying this. I don't know why this being a, a zero sugar, zero calorie beverage is so much better than perhaps um, Pepsi or, or or Diet Pepsi or Diet Coke. I think I I, I always like regular Coca Cola better than Pepsi, but I always like Diet Pepsi better than regular. I mean, re better than Diet Coke. 
and I'm not sure why people would give me the, these. I, they weren't things that I really would purchase. I wouldn't go to the thing and buy you know, one of those big 24 can boxes and throw it in my cart of Diet Pepsi or Diet Coke. Uh, so it'd be more of something that I just would have. Um, so I don't know why they're able to make that taste so much better than like a, like a Diet um, Coke. Now, I don't know if I, I probably have had a, a, a Diet or uh, uh, some kind of a Diet root beer. Um, I don't know, Diet A&W or something. I don't know. Um, this one smells really good. So um, I've also had a lot of the generic ones like Springfield and back when there's a Lucky uh, store, Lady Glee and all that. So I have had those before. I have not um, had those in a long time. A lot of those are not available anymore because the stores are not available anymore. But this smells like root beer here smell. Oh, you like it? Good, good, good. Okay, let's see. Now, root beer always seems to have a good fizz to it. And some people think that root beer is not made with any caffeine. Some root beers do have caffeine. Let's see. Does this one? Mm, I don't see anything about that. Um, and some say that the root beer is, uh, is not carbonated. And root beer is not, doesn't have any um, uh, caffeine. Now, this root beer, I just poured it. And you notice the root beer, which is traditionally... Uh, will have like this one they they didn't even bother to try to show that it has foamy a foamy head on it but this one for the root beer does and you notice the root beer doesn't really have one so i don't really know why so let's see if it tastes i'm only dealing basically with taste not necessarily the appearance of or what the can looks like or the backstory of where nixie n-i-x-i-e where it came from where what it's all about so i'm just gonna try it Good. This one's good too. This one, I don't know if you ever tried Kool Aid root beer back in the 70s, maybe, maybe all the way up into the early 80s, or whatever. But it was a pouch of about, I don't know, one hand, about that big. And it had the sugar already in there. You poured it and you'd add the water and it would come out to be root beer. This tastes kind of like that, or that candy bottle caps. Did you ever try that? So this doesn't taste exactly. The one I tried before, the, the, the cola one, it was a day, would you like a Coke? And they handed that to me in a glass. I may think that's Coke, a cola, <laughs> Coca-Cola, or Pepsi. I would think this right here, I think that has a kind of a weird taste, but I, there's so many different companies of root beer, some that go back, you know, what, over 100 years. Uh, so if you look at the root beer company since 1910, since 1915, since 1889, whatever, um, they came, I remember when root beer first came out, they called it root tea, T-E-A, root tea. But the cowboys and the tough fellers says, I don't want to drink all root tea. But well, I'm, I'm beer drinking. Well, we hear some root beer, and they had the root beer. And I guess that's the history, to my knowledge and my in-depth research on root beer. But it's good. It has a this one has a little bit of a aftertaste. It's not an unpleasant aftertaste. It's just a little unfamiliar aftertaste but I would have to say I I like them I like them both probably like the cola a little bit better which surprised me because I thought I would definitely like the root beer more uh, when it comes to the um, is it Zevia or Ziva whatever it is Ziva maybe uh, I did this I did I did one back that way on the cola if you want to go back to the back you'll see some of those but um, yes yeah, so I thought that I was gonna like the root beer more but I think I actually like the cola more I like them both actually thank you so much Please like this. Please share it. Hey, folks, look at this. Here you can have some cola or some root beer. If you could do that, that'd be great. So they can see it. They might say, well, I wish I knew where to get a good tasting root beer or cola. Now they know. So please subscribe, like, share, comments down below. Have you tried any of the um, ooh, ah, Nixie products? For breakfast this morning, I had, I had some yogurt. And I had some strawberries. That was my breakfast. So this is just kind of like an after thought. I'm getting ready to go and do a couple of things out. And then I'll be back. If you uh, have ever tried this, please let me know down there. If you're going to try it, please let me know. I don't know where it is available. Probably things like Whole Foods, Sprouts, that kind of, those kind of stores. I would imagine they would have that. Maybe it's in the mainstream stores. Maybe it's at Albertsons or Ralph's or Kroger or whatever you have where you are. Publix. <laughs> whatever you have, Piggly Wiggly, whatever you have near you, they probably have it there too. Take care. Have a great day. This should be out, I, I believe, Monday. You know, 
Don't don't quote me on that if I think it's gonna come out on Monday. Take care.